everybody. I'm here in Mesa Verde National Park. This is Farmer Brian and this is my son Leas. Say hi Leas. Hello. And we are here in a very special part of the park where the ancestral Puebloan peoples, the Native American peoples who lived here, they created a real special terracing system to grow their crops. Leas, would you like to tell them what a terrace is? Yes. So for example, there's different levels of places where you plant your crops. And what happens is when it rains, the water stays longer in one level. So the Native Americans were trying to conserve water. Yeah. It's basically like a series of steps. And the water would come into the first step and it would soak in. And it would come into the second step and soak in the third step. So I don't know if you can see here, there's rocks that go all the way around here and there's another level up there and so it's like steps and then we come down here to the next step can you see those rocks all the way around there they piled those rocks about five or six rocks high into a wall and that makes that terrace and then we get to here and here right up close look at these Here's the terrace right here. And as we move down this little gully here, the water's coming down. Here's another terrace right here. Come over here and take a look from this side. It's really cool. They used to grow the three sisters here, the beans, the corn, and the squash, the squash right? And what do they call that in Spanish? Las Tres Hermanas. Las Tres Hermanas. And that gave them all their proteins and all the amino acids they needed. And then we move further down. And here's yet another terrace. And now the goalie's getting more narrow and getting steeper. And the terraces continue. And then the last one looks like it's right there and then it drops off into the canyon but just imagine like 70 years ago these used to be full of corn 700 beans, years squash. ago 700 years yeah full of what beans corn and squash that's right around 1500 years ago the ancestral Puebloan people that lived in this area now protected in Mesa Verde National Park began to build their homes Archaeologists have found villages, or pueblos, that began to be built starting around 900 years ago with thick stone walls. Many buildings were two or three stories tall. These pueblos were surrounded by fields of crops, including Las Tres Hermanas, the corn, beans, and squash. Corn was all important to the people. A grass originally from Mexico Corn became an integral part of their lives, their diet, social structure, architecture, and it played an important role in art, ceremonies, and dance. Corn could be easily stored from one year to the next, and it was planted in wet soil in the spring after the snow had all melted. As the corn and the other crops grew, they received water from the summer rains. The crops were not irrigated, they only received water from the rain. The people here did build reservoirs, such as this one, but this water was used for drinking and cooking. In the late 1100s, the ancestral Puebloans started to build their stone pueblos in the alcoves or caves just underneath the rim of the canyons. They still had all their fields up on top of the flat mesa up above. Can you see that alcove on the other side, on the canyon wall, with the stone buildings? Why did they move into these caves? Was it for protection from the weather, rain, snow, and wind? Or was it for protection from other peoples arriving in the area? Archaeologists are still trying to figure this out as they study these fascinating ruins here in the park. Thanks for joining us on this short tour. So hello from Mesa Verde National Park. 